The answer to your question is no. So sorry. I didn't even know I was recording. Well, all right. What's up, guys? Jay Aesthetics here, back with another video. Um, as you can tell by the title, um, well, it says, "Do I train legs?" But then it says, "Explosive leg workout." So I guess I kind of told on myself. Um, so what's playing in the background? Well, not in the background, to the side. Y'all know I have it. I'm in a box in the corner, and the videos in the the main. Um, you know, I don't have to explain myself, but um, this is an explosive leg workout, which is basically all of my leg workouts. Um, but a lot of you guys, because I don't really post any leg pictures or leg workouts or anything like that on any of my social media. So a lot of you guys are like, wow, this guy skips leg day. He doesn't um, train legs. So I thought I would, you know, clarify it. And um, yes, I do train legs. So as you saw there, I should probably tell you guys what I'm actually doing in the workout. It would be nice. But as you saw, I was just doing some stretches, some regular stretches to warm up. Because I always stretch, especially on leg day. Well, for me, because I don't want to break my knees or my back or my legs or anything. So I always stretch a whole bunch on leg day. And um, I don't train legs like a bodybuilder just because of the fact that it's so, I don't know, boring. It's not boring. It's just... I don't know. So I don't train legs like a bodybuilder. But what I mean by that is like regular regular bodybuilders who do heavy squats for like six to ten reps or something like that. Heavy squats and heavy leg press and all those basic stuff like lunges, leg presses, squats, like just like regular stuff. And just to get like big swole looking legs. I mean, me personally, I don't. I don't need that in my life. I don't need big old thighs. I don't need big quads, hamstrings. I don't need all that. So I don't train for that. I really train um, legs like an athlete. I tell a lot of people that. But I train legs like an athlete, not a bodybuilder. Um, and what I mean by that is, as you can see here, I'm doing some box squats. But I'm not just doing regular box squats. If you look closely, you can see I kind of pause on the bench and shoot up as fast as I can and go onto my tippy toes. As if I'm about to jump. Um, so that's really how I train. Because I used to, when I was really, really, really going hard le with legs, I used to train legs three times a week. And I used to do all explosive work. And um, I was able to, you know, jump pretty high. Like I was touching rim. I think I was close to dunking. I don't know if I actually did dunk. I'm pretty sure I was close to dunking. And me, if y'all saw my other video, I'm not that tall. Uh, I mean, I'm 6'3", but, you know still not that tall so for me to be able to just you know touch rim or almost dunk i probably could have if i tried but um that was a big accomplishment for me because you know i don't know i just felt like i was tall for once even though i am tall six three come on um but yes yeah, so i always used to train legs three times a week and it's all explosive work and now i still do train legs more than i train arms in all honesty i train legs twice a week just because y'all know I already hate training arms in all honesty it's just so boring to me curls tricep extension it's just a boring day I just hate training arms so I do train arm I mean legs two times a week and back to what I was saying let me explain this first so what I did um for the, the squat the box squats that I did I did 10 sets of 15 with you go down and pause on the bench and then shoot up as fast as you can and I went onto my tippy toes so I did 10 sets of 15 with that then I came here and did four sets of this, which is, I believe it's 10 each leg. Don't quote me. I believe it was 10 each leg. Then I switched legs. Then I did, I put the weight down and did jumping um, lunges, which is all explosive type of work for me to be able to jump high. Cause I want to get back to there. I mean, I could touch rim now, but I want to be able to dunk. So um, I'm working for that right now, even though I don't even play basketball that much, but it'll be a nice accomplishment. Um, so yeah, all of my leg movements are really, really, really 
high volume explosive work not heavyweight at all because like i said before i don't want big old thighs big old quads I mean, my legs are decent um i just don't take pictures because you know that just seems weird to me i don't know other people do it but i don't know it's just weird in my opinion for me i don't know um maybe i'm being weird maybe no i'm not just in my opinion for me. I, I don't care if other people do it. It's just I probably will never do it. Or put it on social media. But, um, yeah, what was I talking about before? I can't edit this because it's going with the video. So I have to keep my train of thought. Um, dang. Oh, all explosive work, right? So everything that I do with legs is all fast-paced Jumping, a lot of jumping movements, a lot of supersets as well, just like this. And I believe the next workout is coming now. Yeah. Where I just, um, I did 10 jumping lunges. Then I lunged to the other side, did 10, lunged back, did 10, and went again and did 10. So, like I said, it's a lot of high volume, high reps um, type of stuff. Low weight. Because, yeah. So I keep everything very fast paced and a lot of sets. Like I said, that first workout, the uh, box squats, I did 10 sets. And um, my legs are still hurting right now. It's I train legs on Monday. I'm training legs today, but today is Thursday. So um, my legs still hurt from that. Like it actually hurts for me to stand up. Um, I went to go pick up something off the floor and I felt my hamstring stretch, which is, you know, it's always nice. I'm getting completely off the topic here. But that does not matter. But um, honestly, this is really what a lot of my um, leg workouts look like. I always start with the box squats. Like the really fast box squats go down and um, pause at the bottom. Then go up and pretend like I'm about to jump. So I go up on my tippy toes. and But I don't leave the floor. Well, most of the time I don't. Sometimes I'm just going so fast that I come a little off the floor. Which in my opinion doesn't matter. But hey. So I believe I did, how many sets of this one? The last one I did four sets of. This one I think I did five sets of. And this was honestly probably the hardest one. Just because it was so many reps and so many sets, I was just dying. Um, how long is this video? Oh, it's almost done. Maybe I could finish without it being a black screen. I was finished talking what I'm talking about. I just kind of need to wrap it up. Um, yeah, this... This, as you could tell when I do this last set, I think I believe this is my last set. Look how trash my form is. Wow. This is embarrassing. Now I'm dancing. Ooh. Come on. Ooh, mix it up. Come on. I'm good. I'm about to stop bodybuilding and become a dancer right now. But uh that's the end of the video. Um I hope you guys got a little insight on um my personal leg training life um i do want to make a video on why it is important to train legs if you guys want to see that um drop a comment and leave a like because like legs is really one of the most probably it is the most important body part to train just because of the fact that it does produce when you train legs it produces um this hormone that lets the rest of your body grow i should say that for the video let me say that for the video so if you guys want to um watch that video or if you want me to make that video, drop a comment, tell me to make the video, leave a like so I know that you guys actually want to see it. It's actually a really, really key um, tip that not a lot of people know about. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to end up the video here. Make sure, like I said, to leave a like, comment. If you're not already, subscribe. Um, post notifications should be on. Um, if they're not, then just press the little bell thingy, turn them on. And um, I'm going to see you guys in the next video, right? All right. Um, outro. Thank you